Hello everyone, thanks for joining me today. Okay, if you guys hear stomping, that's my kids upstairs in the family room running around with Juno. So excuse that thumping noise. Dioxazine Purple, Ultramarine Blue by Liquitex Basics, Copper, so mine's Copper by Artist Loft, um, Iridescent Blue Green by Studio Acrylics. So that's what I chose as my colors. And so I put them in these lovely squeeze bottles that I bought off Amazon. And I spent my whole morning mixing the colors of the rainbow. See, I did like all the colors. And then I had some pink and another light blue there. But so now they're easily accessible and when I wanna paint, they're ready for me to go, which is great. So moving along, I'm gonna open this. So in here, I have Artist Flow, um, Artist Flow White. Why is my brain freezing? Artist Flow, Artist Loft Acrylic Flow White, good Lord. So yes, that's what's in here with Floetrol, nothing else. I do not have a ratio. I do not use silicone. Um, so a lot of people have been asking me lately, um, what is my ratio? I don't have one. So I just eyeball everything. Um, so that's it. I'm gonna flood my canvas with the white. I went over too far, whoops. There we go. And I'm gonna use my lovely spatula that I love so much and everyone keeps asking me where I got it from. So it's called an omelet turning spatula and the brand is OXO. And for those of you in Canada, you can find it at the Bay or Home Outfitters if it hasn't closed wherever you are because I do know they are closing, which sucks. Um, and I believe Bed Bath & Beyond sells it as well. I'm not sure if there's a Bed Bath & Beyond in the US, maybe, I don't know. But if you can't find it and you're not in Canada, you can always find it on Amazon. And I will have um, a link to the products I use um, listed below. So just click on that link and you can find the products. All right, so moving along, I've got my torch. I've laid my white. I'm going to pop all my bubbles. There we go. And so I think I'm gonna start with the dark blue. Oh, this is nice. Using these is really nice. All right, so dark blue. And I usually puddle pours, but today I'm just gonna do something different. Here's my gold. Oh, I love gold. And my dioxazine purple. Okay. And finally, my quote unquote light blue, like so. All right, I think that's good. And then I will add my white around it. So this as well is the same as what's in um, this, same thing. I just like to put it in a squeeze bottle so that it's easy for me to use and make my pour around. So, all right, there we go. All right, it's been a while since I used the blow dryer or hair dryer, call it whatever you want. All right, let's see what happens. All right, so we've blown it over and let's go back the other way. Lots of purple in there. Wow, pretty. I usually blow on it. I definitely don't wanna blow this. I actually kinda of like that. And it's fallen off the sides here really nicely and there's some really nice cells going on here, which is great. I'll show you guys on the close up. 
But I, you know what? I don't think I want to blow it. I think I actually like it the way it is. And the, I find, I found recently what, what happens when I blow and I get to the edge, as it's drying, it just keeps going, 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 and then falls off the edge. So if I want it to fall off the edge, then yeah, I'll blow on it. But I actually like the way it looks just like this. So I'm not even gonna blow on it. I just, I like it like that. What I'm gonna do is torch it and see if anything pops up here um, in the center, which should. So let's see. There's some of the dioxazine purple coming up. There. So I don't even want to torch the outside. I might torch maybe because there's some really nice cells, white cells going on here. But I'll torch over here. Yeah. So that's it. I don't even want to touch it anymore. So there's a big, nice, dark cluster in here. And I'm really liking the way this turned out. I really like the colors. I don't see much copper in here. It looks like it got lost, so I should have put a little bit more. But there's a bunch here, which you'll see when I bring you down for the close-up. But other than that, I really like the way it's turned out. And I think all my sides are pretty much covered. I'm just gonna work on just some sides over here. Make sure everything's flowing nicely here. You need a little bit over here. Perfect. Touch over here. All right. And I think that side's good. So there we go. Just touch it up here. Perfect, that's it. Let me bring you guys down for a close up. Alrighty, so there it is. So there you can see the little bit of gold. And this is the side I was telling you about. You can see all the cells just coming off the side there. And Pretty cool, the center, I actually really like it. And here's where all my, my light blue, oops, where, there we are. This is where all the light blue ended up, which is really nice. So there it is, guys. Thanks for joining me, guys, on this quick pour. If you like it, give it a thumbs up, please. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. I appreciate all the lovely comments and I love reading them. And if anyone, feels like they'd like to help and donate I do have a PayPal link and you can click on that and help with a donation or a tip and that would be greatly appreciated so thanks very much everybody I will be back with some more videos shortly thanks very much guys have a good night bye